Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new to my channel, my name is Dean and I pretty much do all kinds of creative stuff including building furniture, home improvement, and all other kinds of things. Now in today's video, I'm going to be showcasing the Xtool 55 watt laser. Now since there are already hundreds, maybe even thousands of very detailed videos on how to set up and use the Xtool laser, I'd rather take the time and show y'all all the stuff that I've been making with the Xtool over the last couple of months of having it. And even with having a couple of months of experience with it already, I feel like I'm only scratching the surface of what I can do with this laser. Now, in a lot of these videos, you're going to see that I manipulate the top so I can keep it open and film the laser actually cutting for y'all. So you may see a lot of smoke, but with normal use of the laser with the top shut, it actually has an exhaust fan on it with a hose that comes out the back. Now, they do sell filtering systems that you can run that hose to if you were going to put this in the house. Now, in my case, I'm in the shop, so I just went and purchased a dryer vent like you would have on the side of your house for your dryer and put that in the wall and connected the hose to it. So all the smoke that's in the machine would normally go outside. Now, of course, this is great for hobbies, but it's also great for starting a small business. There's lots of things like my gears that you really can't get online or you can't get the styles or designs that people really want. So I have been able to find a little bit of a market being able to cut these gears out and sell them online. Now, I'm sure over the next year after I get more comfortable with the X-Tool laser and come up with more creative ideas, I'll find more things that I can sell online. So this thing will end up paying for itself. And don't be intimidated by the software. Xtool has designed their own software that makes it super user friendly. Within minutes, I was able to start cutting stuff out. And on top of designing their own user friendly software, they also started their own site where they share all these pre-made designs. There are thousands on top of thousands of designs for free on their website. And then they also have a way where users can actually sell their own designs. So some really complex or really creative stuff that people have came up with, you can normally buy the cuts for a few bucks. I stated before, I feel like I'm just starting to scratch the surface of what you can really do with this software. And even if you're not a creative person or you don't have ideas, like I said, they have millions of ideas on their website already where you can just click a button and cut it out or engrave it or both. So a lot of stuff you see me making today, like that Iron Giant cutout at the beginning of the video, that was already in their software. I just downloaded it and had the machine cut it out on plexiglass. And then on top of that, they have tons of designs to do stuff for fun. Like, so say the grandkids are in town for the weekend and they're getting bored. You can pull up the X-Tool software and you can find puzzles put together, 3D puzzles put together, dinosaurs to put together. So many options and it just takes minutes to cut it out and then the kids can start putting it together. All right, enough talking. Let me show you what I've been doing with this thing. So I almost completely forgot to mention one of the coolest features of this laser. It has a built-in camera right here. And that's not it. It also has a built-in camera here. Now, why is that important? Because if I wanted to engrave on multiple pieces like this, before in the past, without the camera, you would have to build a template for each one of those pieces to set in. You'd have to figure out your measurements, put it on your laptop and make sure everything's precisely exactly where it needs to be. If it's off even a hair, all your engravings are going to come out crooked. So it could be a big pain. But with this camera and that camera, you can see what's on the table and you can put your logo where you want. But this has to be one of the coolest features of having the cameras. You go right over here to applications. You go right down here to batch field. 
go to frame out material and the next screen pops up we just go down here and hit fill now it's going through and calculating where to put all the logos and there you go it figured it out for us how freaking cool is that now we know we're not going to have one that's a little off we're not going to have a whole batch that's a little off we can just throw all of our material in there and it'll put the logos on for us now here's a test batch i still had laying around but this kind of stuff that you can do with the laser they have these with white backing silver backing different colors you can get gold and green on top but you just set your laser up takes a layer off you end up with that but that's what you end up with and now i can go through and i can heat press that onto hats shirts jackets whatever we have our own logos